Hi friends, our today's topic is Serialism video part 10 and in this video we are going to learn possibility cases. See till now whatever cases we had seen was definite case. But in this video we are going to learn the possibility cases. So first try to understand the concept and then we will try to solve few of the questions right. So a statement is given and then followed by two conclusions are given. So if you read the conclusion, the conclusion one is all speeches are copies right. So see this is a definite statement. If it is definitely true then you answer otherwise you it, the conclusion will be false right. Second conclusion is some speeches being copies is a possibility. Here they are asking is there any possibility if the conclusion one will be true. So here you have to tell the possibility but in the conclusion one if it is definite then only you answer then only you have to tell if the conclusion is true or false. So let us try to draw the Venn diagram and then see which conclusion is true and which conclusion is false. So some pains are copies. So let us draw pain here and some pains are copies. So some part of pain will be copies and some part of copies will be pain right which is this part. And all speeches are pains. So all speeches are pains means all speeches are inside the pains. So this is what this is my basic diagram right. So we might have to draw possible diagram also because in question they have given one conclusion which is completely based on possibility that is not on a definite or a basic or a basic diagram. You have to tell using the possible diagram that if the possibility is correct or false right. So let us take the first conclusion. So first conclusion is all speeches are copies. So when you see the basic diagram, so in the basic diagram itself there is no relation between speeches and copies right. So no need to draw the possible diagram because they are asking definitely means 100% all speeches are copies no speeches are copies there is no relation in the basic diagram only if you will draw the possible diagrams also then that possible diagram will tell you the possibility not the definite 100% results. So this will become false because in the in the basic diagram itself there is no relation between speeches and copies right. Now the conclusion 2 is some speeches being copy is a possibility means some speeches being copy is a possibility. What they are asking is there any possibility that some speeches, speeches will be copies. So okay that we will see in the possible diagram right in the possible diagram because they are asking about the possibility. So what we will do? The first statement is some pains are copies. So this is pains and this is copies right okay and then they are telling all speeches are pains. So all speeches are pains all speeches are pains right and see here now some part of speeches is what copies some part of speeches are what copies. So there is a relation between speeches and copies right okay. So when you are drawing a possible diagram we have to keep in mind your none of the statement should be violated. None of the statement should be what violated. So how will we check? So after drawing the diagram just see the statement if it is true or not. So some pins are copies yes so some pins are copies this is the part. So my statement one is not violated all speeches are pins. Yes, all speeches are pins. My statement 2 is also not violated and by that way we are able to establish a relation between a speech and copies. So I can say there is a possibility that some speeches will be copies right because that we are getting in the possible diagrams right. So our conclusion 1 was false and conclusion 2 will become true because we are finding here a possibility right. Question number 2. A statement is given and followed by two conclusion right. So let us draw the diagram. So some orange are sun. So suppose this is orange and this is sun and all oranges are rings. So all those oranges are what rings and no ring is a cat. So there is no relation between ring and cat right. So this is what this is my basic diagram. And if in the conclusion we are not able to conclude anything then we are go for the possible diagram. So let us take the conclusion 1 and try to find out if it is correct or not. So all cat being orange is a possibility. What they are asking is there any possibility all cats will be orange. Okay, So what we will do we will try to 
bring all cats inside the orange so what will happen when we will bring all the cats inside the orange then what will happen all the cats will become ring also all cats will become ring also when we will bring cat inside the orange right and what will happen it will violate the statement third statement third is clearly mentioning no ring is a cat but when you are bringing cat inside the orange then the statement three is violating that means statement conclusion one is not true conclusion one is false because when we are trying to draw it is violating the statements right now all orange being cat is a possibility now in the second case they are asking can all oranges all oranges be placed inside the cat so we will see if we are trying to place all the orange here then what will happen with the orange with the orange ring will also come because all the oranges are rings and some rings are oranges so some part of ring will also come here and from here again cat and ring will have a relation which will violate the statement 3 right so our conclusion 2 is also false or incorrect right thanks for watching the video